Good morning guys from Tirana, Albania. Today is a very exciting morning because we are starting our North Albania road trip. Jensi is picking us up in, hold on, 40 minutes. I think we have time. We're pretty much packed, um, but, no, we're pretty much packed, but Molly, as we're heading to the North, needs some comfortable trainers because there will be a lot of hikes, but I think I've spotted the perfect location that I'm literally hanging out the window here, but, just down here is a small little market. We're gonna get you some trainers. This was such a spot. This is literally across the road from our hotel. It's like down the side alleys. It's a very, very local market. It's not what you expect to find in the big city of Tirana, but Molly is trying to get some trainers. This is really nice, I like it. Very local though. I did not expect this. It goes on for miles there. This is huge. I think I might just have big feet because I didn't seem to have a size <laughs> six. Um, hello. Oh, no. so that was unsuccessful. They weren't keen on the camera, so we were sort of in and out every single shop, but I didn't find any. They don't have big feet sizes. <laughs> I think we're going to have to get Minj Goda. Thank you very much. And we are on our way to Skodra. I think it will take us about one and a half to two hours. Maybe longer, it's raining. Maybe, Maybe longer, longer because it's raining. It's raining. Yeah. Um, it's to get there. I can't believe it started raining. The weather yesterday was so different, but that is the time of the year. Um, I'm just gonna sit and edit to the video in the back of the car. You, know, you should look for some some trainers on the internet. Yeah, I need to look for some trainers, otherwise this hike is gonna be extremely difficult. But Matt is gonna take charge of the camera. I think while I said I the driver. <laughs> I'm not driving. This weather today is crazy. We have definitely bought the weather across from England. Molly, you are definitely <laughs> Molly is definitely gonna need some trainers for these hikes <laughs> up north. Um, I think we're gonna find somewhere to stop off and have a coffee because it should only take care yeah, about an hour, maybe an hour from here, hour and a half. Hour, hour and a half. And we do have a special restaurant that we're actually stopping at just before Squadra, which you're not gonna see today, you're gonna see tomorrow. So we need to stop off for some coffee before we get to the restaurant. Um, and hope that this rain stops because in the next five days, we do have a lot of hikes, a lot of mountain regions. And if it's raining, <laughs> it's gonna be interesting. Wow, this weather is terrible. We've actually just stopped off in Leja, which is the birthplace of Skanderberg. And it's actually where he's buried. Um, we're gonna go and check that out in a bit, but we've stopped off really nice coffee shops, like along the road, along the highway. It's, it's linked to a hotel, Hotel List, but the coffee shop here looks lovely. How nice is this? So nice. I've, you don't expect this at a petrol station? No, and all along this road, there's actually petrol stations with nice hotels and nice coffee shops. I think it's just the culture, right? Hello. Are you excited for your trip up north? Yes, I'm really excited. <laughs> Even though it's raining, it will be very interesting because we will uh, see, look for adventures. So sometimes it's it's also good like this. Let's hope the rain stops though, right? Yeah, we hope so, but even though if it continues like this, it will be okay also. We are very positive. Yes, we'll stay positive. And yeah. what else do we need to know about this town of Leja? Leja? Yeah, Leja is in fact town, a small town uh, nearby Shkodra, like 30, mi 30 minutes driving from Shkodra. And it's important because it is the birthplace of our national hero Skanderbeg. There is also a castle uh, up in the hill of Leja. Uh, but it's not very like, let's say, famous like comparing with Kruja and Škodra castle. But it's also important to uh, mention it because there is also the graveyard uh, of Skanderbeg in this place. A quick coffee done and we have just popped to see the Skanderberg sort of grave, his memorial. It's also a church because he was Catholic. Um, he actually died at 84 years old, which is really old for a leader of that time. I think it was around the 1400s. Um, but look at this. I mean, this is, you can see here, it looks like a palace. This is his grave all along the river here and you have the castle there. It's very scenic. 
It's actually a really nice city. It's a shame that the weather's this bad because we could have gone over and seen it and I wanted to fly the drones. It's a really nice river. Obviously where it's very big, but I'm getting back in the car. The weather's horrible. And we have just finished a special food vlog that you will see oh, tomorrow. Stay tuned for that, but we're back on the road to Skoda now. About 45 minutes? 45 minutes. 45 minutes to there. Hopefully it's not raining there, but I'm sure the rain has followed us all the way from Tirana today. So we have made it to our amazing place that we are staying it is called Camping Leganda. So they normally have camping here too. Obviously there's not many at the minute, but it's a campsite and these wooden lodges. The grounds are huge. We can't exactly show you everything right now. I'll come out with a GoPro in a bit. Yeah, I'll come out with a GoPro. But quickly come, let's go and see our lodge. Wow, wow, come under. Oh wow, this is incredible. Right, hang on. Wow, come in and then come around there. So this is our first time even seeing this completely, wow. Oh my gosh, how would you describe it? It's like a proper it's a log, cabin. log cabin. So I'm just gonna see, there we go. Oh, that's better. this is lovely. We have, I'm assuming that's storage space over there. We have a big bed. Oh my god, Matt, this is, this is crazy. Follow you? Yeah, let me come round. I'll open the, oh wow, look, you can do the bathroom. I did the bathroom, oh, it's really nice. Sink, toilet, shower. You can hear the rain, it just sounds, it is exactly what it is. You're like, we're camping, but we're in our own little lodge. I did not expect the weather to be like this at all, but this is really, really nice. It's cozy, you can hear the rain, hitting the top of the chalet. Chalet, would you call it a chalet, Molly? Yeah. You'd call it a chalet, a lodge. You'd hear the roof of the lodge. But this place is camping legenda, and we're very pleased to have found this place, actually. It's quite unique. It has five or six different lodges. Uh, it then has a campsite, so you can come in with a camper van or a tent. And it then has a normal hotel, like fully functioning hotel. So it has like three, three in one. It's like a hostel, a hotel, a campsite. And it has a little bar over there, which is very nice because I don't see us doing too much today with this rain which is a shame. Um, but I will go out and try and show you some more of it, if not tonight. Uh, I'll definitely do it tomorrow if the rain stops. I'll have to go out with the GoPro worst comes to us. There is a swimming pool as well. I don't think the swimming pool, I think it's a little bit off limits, but we are about two kilometers outside of the Škoda city center, which we'll be exploring tomorrow. Um, but for tonight, I think we're gonna walk out. Well, we'll, I'll bring you with us. We're gonna check out the bar that they've got here. Hopefully this rain stops. Good morning guys, we slept so well in our little fairy tale lodge um, but we didn't want to end yesterday's video without showing you really quickly around the beautiful grounds here. So there is a few of these chalets or lodges and they are all so different. They've got mosaics on them which is handmade by one of the owners, there's hammocks and this grounds here. Is that even a that two room. There's some two floor ones yeah, we've, we've think, missed out here. I think that's possibly a family room. Um, they're all so, so big. You literally are in the middle of the forest. It doesn't feel like you're just outside the city. It's, it's really, really unique. You've also got showers over here. So if you are camping, there are showers. There's also cooking facilities, but I want to show you our favorite spot. And that is this place. It feels like a fairy tale, doesn't it? <laughs> it's beautiful. So I, what would you call this? It's sort of- um... A veranda? Yeah, it's a veranda on top of the swimming pool. I mean, I just feel like a really important person up here. Uh-huh. I've got all these lovely white cloaks. Obviously the pool down below. And just over here, you can actually see the castle of Skodra. And all here are parking spaces with gas and water. For your camper van or tent. Now it's time to end today's video. <laughs> Yesterday's video. Yeah, so amazing sleep here. We'll see you in like two minutes time. Two in minutes tomorrow's time. video.